With MAGFOS, um, we often refer to it as being the muscle relaxant. Remember the theme of the aggression. The aggression is often depicted or expressed in the muscle uh, tissue. So we find a lot of tension, a lot of spasming occurring within muscle tissue. In terms of a bit of a background energy, um, magnesium uh, plays a very important role in energy production. So we talk about ATP, adenosine triphosphate production. Um, and so when we have a deficiency in MAGFAS, we tend to find fatigue or an inability for muscles to fulfill their function optimally. So things like cramping or a weakness in muscle contraction tends to occur. It's fantastic for treating any kind of pain. So depending on the cause of the pain. Now, if the pain is associated with muscle spasm or tissue trauma, um, MAGFAS is fantastic for, but if it's associated with nerve uh, um, association, I would probably more be inclined to think of things like uh, CALIFOS um, as a nerve nutrient. So it really just depends on the individual. What you could do if you're uncertain if the cause of the pain is from a nerve problem or a muscle problem, you could do a combination of the CALIFOS and the MAGFAS together. It's a fantastic antispasmodic. So antispasmodic, this is something that is a muscle relaxant, particularly for the digestive tract. So here we think of things like IBS, yeah, so applying it in situations of IBS or colic in infancy, fantastic uh, antispasmodic here.